Welcome to match week 6 of the Premier League where Chelsea are eagerly awaiting the return of their king Romelu Lukaku. He will join the Blues for 105 million pounds just like Jack Grealish did for champions Manchester City. Super Jack replaces the injured De Bruyne in midfield and plays a big part in City's siege. Grealish is denied by Mendy and tries to set up Gabriel Jesus but the Brazilian misses. At the stroke of halftime, City have a deja vu from the lost Champions League final, but this time Kai Havertz makes the wrong choice. It takes 65 minutes until Jack Grealish is off the mark for his new employer. What a magnificent start for Super Jack. But Chelsea hit back with a perfect cross from Timo Werner, a wonderful first touch from Pulisic and a tremendous finish from the American Quite a stunning goal. Chelsea are happy with a point, but City want more. Grealish to Jesus, what a stop from Mendy. And also the corner kick is dangerous, but Ruben Diaz hits the post and it ends with a fifth draw for the Blues. Leaders Leicester City get a visit from Burnley who are still looking for a first win. James Madison misses the only chance in the first half. And the Community Shield winners have to dig very deep this time. But Madison finds Jamie Vardy in stoppage time. And he makes it six wins in a row for Leicester City. Aston Villa purchased Jamaican winger Leon Bailey and Southampton striker Danny Ings. And the new boys come close to success at Man United's Old Trafford. Leon Bailey with the dribble, but his shot hits the post. It's United's new prodigy Jadon Sancho who creates the opening for Eddie Cavani. But what a cool finish from the Uruguayan to win it. Six goals for him, 16 points for United. After Arsenal also Tottenham have a new number four, the Argentinian Christian Romero. Son misses a chance to put Spurs in front. And after that it's time for the Alex Lacazette show. A cross from Pepe finds Lacazette even though Romero was marking him. Beautifully done from the Frenchman. And Romero is lucky that Hugo Lloris stops Lacazette from getting a double. Son has one more attempt to save Spurs from a first defeat. But the Korean fails and so do the Spurs. Brentford FC haven't lost a single match yet in the Premier League. But Liverpool is obviously too strong. Henderson opens the score. Jensen misses a free kick. And Diogo Jota finishes it 2-0. Leeds are merciless against West Ham and their goalkeeper Areola. Patrick Bamford gets the first two goals for the Peacocks. But Calvin Phillips definitely gets the most beautiful one today. What a rocket. Rodrigo helps Bamford to complete his hat-trick. And Leeds United jump to fourth place with 13 points. The local rivalry between Crystal Palace and Brighton ends with 0-0. And Watford strengthened their midfield with Kuchka who joins from Parma. But if your defense is a mess, who cares about your midfield? Callum Wilson and John Joe Shelby make it 2-0 for the visitors from Newcastle. But thankfully Ismail Lassar is still a hornet. His cross finds the head of Cucho Hernandez who returned from a loan spell in Spain. But once more, errors in defense lead to a goal from Jeff Hendrick. Sar's next cross leads to an own goal from Fabian Scher and Watford get the ultimate chance to avoid defeat. Joshua King with the shot but Dubravka denies him a point 2-3. Both Everton and Norwich had hoped for a better start of the season. Dominic Calvert-Lewin puts the Toffees in front and Andros Townsend is inches away from winning it. But the Canaries save a point via Polish winger Zemislav Plachetta, one all at Goodison Park. And finally also one all in Southampton versus Wolverhampton with goals from Musa Genepo and Raul Jimenez. See you next week. Peace.